there's i mean yeah. there's some rocky roads as we all know any any author that's been in the business for more than 10 years knows that there are victories and then there are just crushing defeats that you go through <laughs> and what makes a veteran writer a veteran writer is how they ride out those defeats and then try and come back again you know i was i was one of those authors that got i mean the whole red carpet rolled out for me in 2023 or 2003. You know, I mean, I got the big agent, Donald Moss, you might recognize the name. Um, yeah. He was like the big agent at the time to get for fantasy and science fiction. And we got him, me and my writing partner. And then we got, you know, our book put up for auction and Harper Collins purchased it and that sort of thing. And it was just a dream come true. Right. Yeah. And then it didn't sell to expectation. And uh, the only thing worse in trying to get published than, you know, being a brand new author who has no chops whatsoever is being a proven failure. Oh man. Oh, <laughs> that that man. makes it so much harder to break back in. Right. So we had this trilogy right. that didn't sell the expectations. So we were now cold product and, you know, I spent the oh, next wow. five, six, seven years trying to get back in at which, which point I did with the wishing world and tour books. Um, but then that didn't sell to expectation. Oh, man. <sighs> so, you know, that was, it's just, you know, it's these things that, that, that you get hit with and then you got to roll and you got to keep moving. And it's interesting how now I'm probably on more of a winning streak than I've ever been in my life uh, right. as regards the writing. And it was not because of fantastic victories in the traditional publishing arena, but fantastic failures wow. in the realm uh, of traditional publishing.